<laughs> Yo, what's up? Dude I, dude, I was calling you the whole time. I didn't see. Dude, how long have you been on this? Hours? I just got in. I just got at the right time. I swooped in. Yeah, you, you came in You came in right as I was moving away from this. This is the right time. We can, we can keep farming it. Oh, I mean, I man. talked about this before. Look, you, you had a pretty good take on this as oh, far no, as like, no. harassment you know goes. You, you go from the beginning. You, you know what? I actually, you know what? I wasn't there, and I was just getting pieces from chat. You know how chat is, right? Oh, look at this clip. Look at this clip. Look at I know what the timeline is. Give me the timeline because I'm sure you farm drama all day. You farm, you farm, you farm news, right? So you've seen the, the drama from the beginning to the end. All these pieces, and I act like I knew what was going on. I don't know what the fuck was going on. Just tell me from the beginning. I mean, I just saw a YouTube video of you li thing. literally being like, uh, uh, you know, I watched the Gideon drama, so you don't have to. So you know the original part of it, right? Like with the whole... No, all I... Okay, I heard like the, like, li like the fucking... Like the CNN headline type shit. Like the, the clickbait, fake when news bullshit. I heard, bad. oh... Guy sends people to hatred uh, Pokemon, and I was like, "Oh, well, that can be good." And I, I and I saw some some chatters and some some logs, and that was that's that's about it. I mean, it's just it, it's it's pretty basic. It's just uh, uh I think like Pokey was playing Valorant or something, and then uh, Gideon was on his okay. first day of getting on his first day of uh, becoming partnered. He's like, "Oh, I'm." I'm defeating Pokimane right now. I have more viewers than her. And then he's just like, yo, go to her chat and spam like L plus ratio, whatever. Uh, that's that's already really bad. Yeah, so they do that. So that's already a fucking clap, gotcha. right? Like you would 100% get clapped no matter who that who you do that to. Like, obviously the only difference well, is uh, like if, if opinion, you and I were doing it to each other, that's different. But like, especially when you don't know the person, yeah. right? It, it, my take is that just friendly. This is just in, a, in, in another in another world. You should you should just get banned Thanks for being a viewer count Andy. Like this is my thing. But you can continue. Yeah, well, I I do clap all my viewer count Andys. Um, so that's already like you know that's already fucking bullshit. Uh, and then <laughs> and then uh, on top of that, sorry, Ethan is right, fucking memeing. Um, oh no, 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 no. He's just he's just making fun of. Uh, dude, I hope people don't. Take no, that's real. Seriously. I hope people don't take that seriously. Oh God, people are gonna be like, "This is serious." Um, okay, it is. <laughs> okay, look at the new. I'm, I'm actually just. I'm actually. I'm, I'm both in. Now you got me. You got me hooked now. Now what? Okay, so the L plus ratio shit happens, and then he says some like weird fucking creepy shit. And apparently, like he was doing some other stuff beforehand as well. Like he was already like kind of talking oh, about Pokemon a lot dude, before he even the, did the okay. L plus ratio shit. The the dig down this that was just yeah that stuff weird. is like yeah. completely unacceptable, dude. That is like come the fuck on. And I think even Gideon himself recognizes that that shit is like completely unacceptable because he like apologized for it and said he was it was corny recently, right? I mean that that wasn't corny. That was all all, all, all yeah. fucked up. Uh, no, that's like that, exactly. I'm not I'm not like a snowflake again, but something something that like um I don't even think about something like that because I don't know. It's just gonna it's, uh, it's unnecessary. No, it is it is indefensible. So, um, what he did there is like totally unacceptable. He's like talking about like, oh, you're getting dicked down, whatever. Like, you know, she's getting dicked down. Classic stuff. So now you're like, now you're doing a hate raid and you're being misogynistic. So he gets banned. And then after he got banned or before he got banned in the process of getting banned, he was talking to Ninja through, what I don't ninja? know, gifted subs and shit like that, where he's like gifting Ninja subs and they're talking about him, him like potentially yeah. getting banned. He's talking to like Aiden Ross, uh, and ultimately, and, and, okay. Aiden's initial takes about anything. It doesn't matter. His initial take, look, like, I'm a big Aiden, Aiden Ross fan. Okay, but I'm gonna give this that. Anything, when anything blows up, when he has his own take about something, it's usually just um, garbanzo, right? Usually, yeah, a little bit of reflection. He, he doesn't know shit. He he, he yeah. does not. Especially when I mean, he yeah. himself is young as fuck. Even he was saying, like, oh, that's, like, not acceptable, bro. Like, even... The irony here is that when... I didn't watch everything, but I saw the one clip of Gideon talking to Aiden Ross. Even Aiden Ross was like, yo, you can't say that. You can't say that when uh, Gideon was saying, like, oh, she gets dicked down or whatever. That's, whereas, that's just fucking whereas Ninja, knowing what the fuck this dude was doing, was still like, yeah. I'm going to... I'm going to help. Uh, I'm going to help you. <laughs> it's not the hell to die on. I mean, if you see somebody to say... This person gets dicked down, okay, and you're not like their best friend or their pretty close friend. 
it's already pretty bad. But then the, I feel like Ninja going out of his way trying to try to help that is like um, it's like, dude, what is going on here, bro? Are you okay, brother? Okay, but yeah, like I said, I feel like Aiden's initial thoughts are usually pretty garbanzo, but then with a little bit of reflection, he's not bad. Okay, I'm a roster myself. I mean, I, I, I immediately DM, I mean, I immediately texted him to try to like get his perspective on it because I was like, what the fuck's going on? Like, you know, what, what are you doing, bro? Like, what's your friend doing? But he, he never actually, I mean, swag. I don't know what he said last, but anyway, whatever. He, I, I, I think he means well, but sometimes uh, it does really dumb shit. Anyway, sometimes. but sometimes the person he talks to kind of like rubs on him a lot. Which yeah. Is which is not a problem. But sometimes it is. Yeah. Okay. So, has, continue, continue. Still has, still has high so basically, so basically, all this shit happens, uh, and then and Ninja's like, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna talk to my manager. Like, I'm gonna talk to my Twitch account manager. Whatever. Um, I'm going to, you know, I'm gonna try to get you. Uh, you know, I'm I'm gonna try to do something about your ban, right? Right. Which is like fucking weird. You know, you can't be you can't be the face of the platform for so long, and then. When someone is like very clearly doing a hate raid and very clearly, uh, you know, being misogynistic, uh, you can't be like, I'm, <laughs> I ninja will defend this. You know what I mean? It's just a, it's just a tough battle. Like after acknowledging and, and steering the ship with certain ways, not negatively. I'm just saying how ninja was steering his ship in certain ways, Look at knowing this piece, sussy. what he knows now about the, about, uh, the, the, the environment and the space as NFT and say, right. I think his, him coming out. And this is the hill he's gonna fight on for me. It was like a, a very like such a big gap. It was such a big distinct like fucking you know length. You know like why this? Why that? Could have been anything. You know. Yeah. It's just weird. I I think he was just trying. Honestly, I think he was just trying to fucking be cool. Like that's what I think. I think he was just like this is a young guy, is a new guy. I right. think. I think he's. He was just like trying to play it cool, obviously. Like he didn't even reach out to his manager, apparently. He just lied about it. <laughs> so if yeah, anything, like, Gideon got uh, fucked over. He g gifted him a hundred gifted him a hundred subs with the hopes that he was gonna hit his fucking manager up and you know. Nothing. Yeah. He didn't even get that. <laughs> so Yeah. Also, but for the record, I don't think I make should be permanent. Uh after one I don't I don't either. I don't think so. I think permanent I mean look. The first thing he does on the fucking platform is this. So I totally understand why Twitch took that decision. You know yeah. what I mean? This is the it's first day is. of his partnership. Like, I mean, obviously Twitch is like, what the fuck? Especially because he doubled down on Twitch or, or after Twitch, he went on Twitter, changed his fucking profile picture to like Pokemon without makeup. Very clearly, you know, very clearly kept like hyping this up. And I think it's because he's like, he's a troll. This is his content. You know what I mean? Especially with the enforcement of uh, of platform rules, which is like, he went uh, live on Instagram. Oh, kept, that's like, tough. Yeah, oh, he went shit. live on Instagram and like kept fucking harassing. You know what I mean? Like kept fucking directing his viewers whichever oh, way he could yeah. towards Pokemon. So like now she's getting uh, now she's getting like attacked on all platforms. Right? He right. might not realize what he's doing. He might think I'm just farming. Like this is normal. You know? He might be used oh, to that because like I looked at Jesus some of his content. Bro and yeah so somebody's gonna put a stop to it before and and, and then reform yeah it. so that's probably the damage. reason why twitch was like yeah fuck that oh and then i got promoted and apparently yeah they apparently switched his band to a perma after he changed his um well, well, i didn't know he that changed his profile I, picture. I thought they had a, a retake uh on the band and so I, I, didn't, I didn't agree i didn't agree with him if they think this, this is a two weeks and they do it two weeks right and then they're like you know what this is actually a perma that's fucking stupid. That should never happen. But now you tell me that, that there's actual new information that came out that came to light and new behaviors, right? Then that 100% makes sense then. Because then for doubling down, right? And then you're, you're going uh, hard on it. Yeah. And you're continuing to be able, and you're going to do, do infractions literally because the off platform is enforced. I mean, that, that's just, that's what's going to happen, you know? Yeah. Um, so I get why Pokey, I, I get why Pokey did all this though. Like, usually look we all we all make jokes and shit like that you know what i mean we all sometimes say things that could come across as misogynistic and uh yeah. oftentimes it's like it's rarely ever such a clear-cut example and it's rarely ever shown in such a perfect way 
Misogyny uh, pushes girls away from the platform. It's I know people are going to say I'm a fucking cringe SJW or whatever the fuck. But even if you want, like, I mean, you, you know, ultimately, it's, it's for everyone's benefit that uh, girls think that this is a safe space and can easily, you know, create content on the platform, okay, chat I mean, on the I platform. Mean, okay. It's a good thing overall. It's not a bad thing. Maybe you can even fucking find a girlfriend. Okay, chatters. But Brother, you could even flat this argument, right? For people that, that, that disagree with you so much about your takes about women and how, and how they're treated, you could, you could literally flat out this argument and just say that the behavior that, 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 was, that happened would even would, would have still the same result if it was to a male and a man. It, 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 it's irrelevant yeah. at this point. Oh, no, for sure. No, that behavior absolutely. is just that would, to anybody at all, anybody whatsoever, to anybody. So, I just think that, like, I just think that people would not. There's a pile on effect, right? There's an aggravating factor. I, I, I don't even, I don't even disagree with you. I think like Twitch would ban someone if they were doing it to a dude, 100%. But I feel like the aggravating factor of it being not only a woman, but also a Pokemon who's like a target for this sort of shit regularly. I feel like that activates something, you know, when people shit on me. Okay. I'm going to bring this back to myself for a second. When people shit on me, I have like different communities that hate me, right? So I feel like it's yeah. a it's a signal. It's like ding 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 ding. Oh yeah, it's time to fucking pile on. So when they oh, see no, that, for sure. they jump on it and they use it as a fucking way to like yeah, pump yeah, yeah. that into the stratosphere. Like, and I feel like she has a lot of that too. Yeah, because she has a lot of running trains that are always running, but you just can't see them. Right? Yeah, and it's easy for them to preach to the choir and hop on the train and say, "Guys, I'm putting a torch in the air, boys. Everybody, hop on the train." Because the train is always going full steam in the background, you know. We, me and you, we don't have that many, that many uh, maybe you have more than I do, but we all have our own like trains, a little bit of steam in them, right? People yeah. can say, oh, dude, remember when you did this and that? that? Yeah, you, but something like Pokey, though, she has a bunch of them. Like, yeah, oh, oh dude, yeah. Well, she and, and there's viewers, multiple so aggravating for... factors there. And one of the aggravating principles there is that she is a female content creator. She is the female content creator. You know what I mean? Like, she's like the face of, uh, of being a woman on Twitch. So for, for many, many years. So of course, because of that, she has a lot of people. Anytime, anytime anything happens, in most of the circumstances, she's the one being fucking harassed. Even then, uh, people find it as a great opportunity to just keep dunking on her over and over and over again. Yeah, I mean, it's basically that Keemstar. I should say Keemstar is actually a, a mass misogynist, and he keeps those trains heated at all times. I'm just gonna say, motherfucker. Okay, okay. okay. Keemstar keeps those trains running all the time. He, he, even when it's flat and we talk about anything, he always tweets something to reignite and re put more coal in those trains that keep him going. About, like, oh yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can't believe people still watch this knowing that they subscribe to somebody who has three boyfriends at night. Like, what the fuck is that, brother? You're fucking stupid, brother. What is this? No, that's this whole, that's this whole shit. Like, that's. Uh, that, that's this whole shtick is just like piling on, which is funny. You know what? We know what's great about that. I was talking about this the other day and people got very mad at me. That is SJW behavior. That's literally the cringe SJW shit where like people may have done something in the past, but they've changed. Right. And you keep fucking constantly using that against them to prove a point. It's not even to drive home the fucking idea that the person that you're talking about is a bad person. Keemstar does that all the fucking time. And then... Yep. He turns around and says, oh, SJWs do this. It's cancel culture. It's cancel culture. It's like, motherfucker, you're doing that. That's all you do. All you do is really? add aggravating fucking old shit that people have done, even if it doesn't stick, even if it doesn't have anything to do with the actual fucking issue at hand. And it, there's a lot of people like that, that, that engage in this, you know? That, that motherfucker keeps up, spends more time on the internet than with his kids are dead. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I, listen, I read that in chat. I shouldn't have read that. I'm, okay, I'm happy. Listen. I'm happy that he's doing that instead of fucking spending all of his time outside of high schools looking for his next girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? Uh, okay. <laughs> 18, 18 years old, <laughs> allegedly. We don't know. God, I'm dude. Listen, listen. I know, but this somebody needs to talk about this. Okay, it's always sort of under the uh, under the rug. What does this pokey boyfriend mean? What, what the fuck is that, dude? But what is it? There, no, no, there's like... Which one? Oh, Which one? There's many. Like, Pokey has a boyfriend um, off stream that doesn't show him because she wants to milk everybody's subscribers. Oh, dude, it's, it's a bullshit. It's sex is bullshit. It's just like, the only reason why you watch a woman is because you want the girlfriend experience. Which is a self-report. It's projection, you know what I mean? That person who's saying like... 
that person who says that is saying that they can only watch a woman on the platform to treat them like, Excellent. you know, that's their girlfriend. So anyone who says shit yep. like that is technically, you know, admitting to everyone else that they're like kind yeah. of a fucking weirdo. And that's the like only the, way they can consume uh, see, the content of women. See, like the only appeal would be either either romance, right? Or like sex appeal, whatever you call that, right? Like like yeah. uh, like uh, like sexual attire or whatever the fuck, right? Yeah. W which is very disin it's super dis disingenuous, right? Because it's it's already a very male dominated platform. Most viewers are male. Most streamers are male. And the story, right? Oh, yeah. So. It, 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 it's just odd though. Like even let's say in a realm in the world where she did have a boyfriend. So what? So what? Yeah, it's Sometimes their personal you, 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 you don't want to show business. Yeah. It's their personal business. It, it's no one else's. It's so fucking strange that like a lot of people because of the way that this content is created on here where we are very close to our communities, where we're constantly talking back and forth with our chats and whatnot. People feel like they have ownership over every facet of your life where they're like, I need to know if you have a boyfriend or a girlfriend or not if you're single like bitch what's it to you you know what i mean like yeah let people live let people do whatever the brother fuck brother i i had a roommate for three years just because i didn't want to go out to say go god girlfriend girlfriend nobody's calling me out for milking my female juicers out of their hard-earned money to the <laughs> scum oz them who who nobody ever did that nobody ever somebody said anything about that yeah, well, that's, all... yeah, that's because you're, you know, because you're a fucking gamer pog. That's why everybody watches you because you're a warlord, but women only get watched because they're the girlfriend experience. You know, See? that's it. But that, I think they, they project it because that's how they view and consume yeah. female streamers because that's how pathetic they are. It, 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 that, is, that is legitimately a, a, a one to one ratio plus L. Uh, a projection, right, of, of what, of how they act and what they do and how they use the, how they fucking consume these products. They literally go, they, they literally go on Twitch, and they probably, just, oh, my, oh my god, this, this is my next girlfriend. Hey, what up, baby? What up? Like, it's just weird, brother. Oh, look at my lawyer dog. I'm getting countersued. What the fuck is that, brother? Oh, that's me. That's young me, bro. That's young Hassan. That's it. I'm in Turkey in that photo too. You know, you guys can also uh, have a glow up one day, is what I'm saying, you know? Dude, 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 you look like you're about to fucking, I don't know, like, like pull out a saber out of nowhere or some shit. Dude, this is me studying the blade, okay? Everybody was out there getting pussy. I was studying the fucking blade, brother. Eesh. Look at those fucking sideburns. I, I couldn't grow a beard, so that's all I could grow. Terrible. Yeah, the, the, how do you call the turkey swords? They have a name. It's, um, brother. What, oh, the there. saber? Yeah, there's, there's like a name. Called. I don't know I, what it's called in English. Hi, maybe, maybe a scimitar? A oh, scimitar? Yeah, that could be one. Of, yeah, I mean, that's one of them, but... Blade Studiers, Jiga Chad. An Itagon? No, that's not what it is. You, you like this emote? The Jiga Chad? I love the Giga Chad, yeah. They made, they put my it's face on risky. it. Giga Hoss. Ah, <gasps> oh, I see how it is. They kind of ruined it. Oh, Falchata, Falchata. That's, uh, that's one of them. Yeah, 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 true. Yatan and Falchata. They, they had it in Forge in the Fire. Oh, by the way, I'm going to go and uh, make Happy a blade anyone, if you want to come. Uh, I'm going to do like a Forge in the Fire stream where I go make a blade no with Valkyrie. Shot. That's that's fucking wicked, man. Yeah, if you want to come make your own blade, your your uh, Brother, this is that your would invite. Be, that'd be Wait, are insane. you still in LA? Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, damn, dude. Fucking dog shit internet. I'm glad you, you got it fixed. It's getting, it's getting fixed now. Yeah, it's better now. Yeah, it's pretty awful. All right. Well, hopefully I was able to uh, explain the, the drama to you. Hopefully. Well, wait, wait, wait. You didn't finish the story, though. What part of the story were we at? Oh, it's just like ultimately Ninja said something along the lines of like, uh, you know, I didn't actually do that. Uh, he even sent like this like weird threatening text message. Or not text message, DM where it was like, you're making a big mistake. Um, yeah, that's like, that's like my, my dad is a lawyer energy, though. Yeah, well, then, and then Jessica, uh, who you've had a bout with in the past, who very famously always makes things a little bit worse for no fucking reason whatsoever, she also sent her, like, uh, we're pursuing litigation type fucking type of message, which Ethan's making fun of here, uh, where she said, we're considering everything, uh, 
We're considering everything defamation of character at this point and are getting our legal team involved. You are spewing lies to tens of thousands of people. You know Twitch. You claim to know his rep. Then you know from them that Tyler never reached out to anyone. And again, just said that to stop the harassment in his chat from Gideon's viewers. We have clarified everything to you. You are actively bringing harassment to Tyler and I right now at the highest level, and we are taking this very seriously. How would you pursue this anyway? Let's say you were to prove... Let's say you were to, you were to uh, sue for, for, for the defense of character. Like, what's the loss here? Like, what's the... Uh, I don't, so I don't know America has like really, really good protections uh, because of uh, free speech. They have really good protections against uh, uh, against defamation of character and slander, where it's really hard to fucking sue someone over that. What they would have to do is, first of all, they could file for they could you know sue for damages. Okay. Um, well, what damage though? The damage meaning like uh, the you the would, you would you would have to quantify that and have to show examples. Yeah. Of what you what, what it was and what it's now and sort of the gap behind it and sort of the the, the, the downwards trend type of thing, right? You yeah. Short, that that amounts to a dollar amount or so much correlation to it. Yeah. No. Exactly. But uh, I don't know how they could justify that. I'm sure there's a way to do that. But the other part, the other part of it, like you could just say, like loss of income, right? But the other part of this is that, like, you would have to prove that they intentionally uh knew that this information that they were spreading was oh, wrong would cause that. and continued to do it knowing full well that it could cause damage to your character and obviously that's not going to happen because the greatest defense against defamation is the truth All right which and, is you just saying the truth then yeah and there's a video of ninja being like yeah i'm calling my manager right now my account manager right now yeah i'm gonna get it dealt with Okay, it's it's like it's like it's like it's, it's a public document out there, right? That says I, me, right? I I robbed the bank, okay? And somebody posts and says, "Look, guys, look what I found in public records. X robbed the bank, lol," right? And it's like, oh, okay. Well, I wouldn't be able to sue for defamation, right? Because it's like, well, you know, it, it it's out, it's out there, it's there, and it's the truth, right? Yeah. Right. He also he also literally said, "Okay, I sent the text message." You know what I mean? Oh damn, Mr. Beast is even getting involved in it. It's it's this is you know turning into a big drama. Everybody loves drama, though. Everybody does love drama. I it's, love drama. I yeah. love drama. It's a, it's a, listen. What else are we gonna do? Fucking play video games, bro. There's no vi there's no video games out. So For real and true. And so obviously, this is the one. This is the one thing we got going on. It's pretty funny usually whenever people are just like, um, actually, like, this is a video game platform. This is a video game platform. Or, like, people that act like they're above fucking oh, drama. No. They yeah, love they, this shit the most. So so they're called content purists. And you're going to see them more and more on Twitch until they get kind of, like, uh, uh, filtered down. It's, it's, the, it's the concept that, uh, that a certain type of content has a higher priority, right? Even if it's underappreciated and not even watched by anybody, it was like, but that's just better. Right? These people are boomers. They're boo just like you doing the settings when you get into a game. Like you don't know what the fuck you're doing. Right? <laughs> okay, like, bro. Same thing. Why are you right? fucking calling me out like this? <laughs> I've seen you on these intro screens. Okay, it's five minutes in the settings, the reading chat. I said like, this is bad. Well, it's, listen, listen. It's boomer. I don't know. I don't know what my every every game is a different setting. Okay. True. That's all I'm gonna say. And sometimes it's different, but. I know. I just like, I get annoyed with that yeah. too, where it's like, bro, first of all, if you're, you know, I mean, I'm not going to relitigate the DMCA shit, but if you're not going to, uh, you know, if you're not going to violate copyright, then you should be fine. Don't worry. Like leave that up to us. Okay. We'll, True. we'll take the, we'll take the fucking L. True. They, they, uh, but people say, oh, it's going to affect, affect everybody. Right. But what does anybody have to worry about anything? If you, there's nobody's breaking the, breaking the thing. It, it's, it's like, um, yeah it's like it's like it's like if there's a bank that's like that's broken and open and then there's money inside and but he's taking like like dollars and dollars and dollars and, and, and somebody takes a big chunk and like, yo brother brother you're gonna root for all of us man what what are, what are you doing brother and and people start complaining it's like okay well i mean if you're if you're not robbing it right you have nothing to worry about right you're not gonna cover anything because you're not robbing the same thing right yeah right. i mean exactly if you're not, and then, but then they also say like, oh, you're ruining for all the other people that are stealing the what? dollars. It's like, well, okay, then don't point at them. Like, don't call the cops on them.
You know, why are you fucking, why are you calling the cops uh, and, and, you know, pushing for more, uh, pushing for more people <laughs> sure. to pay attention to it. What do you got? Only robbery analogies today? What's going on, bro? You, you got RP brain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I'm on, I'm on fucking, yeah, I'm on that fucking robbery mindset right now. Yeah, just, okay. All right, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, uh, farm yeah. some fucking, you know, uh, master show me, show chef. Me. Wait, do you, have you finished it? No, I'm at season nine, but I didn't start it yet. Jesus Christ, dude! Holy shit! You've been. I'm hooked. Fucking... I'm, I'm hooked on cartoons. Yeah, it, it, gets, it, it gets even worse when I go offline. I I jerk off to that shit now. It's just it's fucking busting. You jerk off the hentai? Well, not hentai, but there's like some good like animated ones that are like not like hentai hentai, but they're just like like what anime, just animated version of shit, man. They're, they kind of go hard, man. Like okay, well then send me some, uh, you know, send me some some examples. I want to look at it so I can say I'm not going to look at that. You know what no, I mean? I, I have to get it up on my other phone, and it's it's gonna take a while. I I keep the bookmarks on my other phone so that I don't I don't like accidentally uh, uh, link and shit like that. But I got some good food or shit in there for sure, though, for sure. But that's just that's more my private life. I don't I don't go into that too much. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, good luck. Yeah, man. All, All right, right, brother. All right, peace. See you, man. Dude, so good. So fucking good, dude. It's me!